Hi guys, Barnaby for Spurred on outside the lane. It's very cold, but we're still here. We want to talk about the game. We just drew tour with Leicester in the FA Cup. I'm going to come to you first, mate. How do you feel after that? Some people feeling pumped, some people feeling a bit down about the, the fact that we got ourselves in that situation in the first place. Well, I was impressed with the comeback, um, but I've sort of mixed feelings about the replay, but obviously replay is better than a loss. Um, obviously, maybe you can use this as a bit of practice for Wednesday. Hopefully get them, because I think that one's going to be more important. If we get that one in the bag, then hopefully you can Rush us on the side and maybe get something out of the King Power Stadium. Yeah. We get, sorry, forget about Leicester when we get there. Yeah, the King yeah. Power was there a, was there a feeling with, amongst everyone you think that this was the slightly li less important one and Wednesday's more important? Obviously, we're still in the cup draw, which is important, but when it comes to it, Wednesday's the big one. We got to turn them over. Absolutely, yeah. I was saying that actually to a friend before the game. You know, it's it's that thing, isn't it, about lacking ambition? But really, Wednesday night's a massive game. You know, we could really do without the replay. Obviously, um, we've got another game Saturday at 12:45, I think, against Sunderland. So it's just another game in a hectic schedule. Um, but obviously, it'd be great to win the cup. But you know, the FA Cup has slowly and slowly become more devalued over the last few years or more, and uh, you can see why. You know, we've rested four or five key players today. Um, we've ended up with a result we didn't really want, you know? Yeah. No, I totally agree, totally understand what you're talking about in terms of the de devaluation of the FA Cup, but if we get to Wem I mean, actually, I'm going to say this. The thing that confuses me slightly is, you know, in the third round and the fourth round, people play reserve teams, but when it comes to the semi-finals and the final, he'll definitely put his first team out if he's there. So it's basically devalued until you get to a certain point. Um, but anyway, like we said, more important in the Premier League. What do you think we need to do? Obviously, I think Leicester on Wednesday night will come out in exactly the same vein, 11 men behind the ball trying to hit us on the break with pace or score from set pieces. What will it take for us to turn them over and really make us believe that we can get into that top three? Um, well, play first team for starters, and I'm going to be honest, I think a win is a must now. I think if we win that, we'll be one point behind Leicester, really in the race for top four and put the gap between us and Man U. So... I think a draw would be a bit dangerous at this point with Man U only three points behind us now and Leicester maybe get, um, getting further away from us. So I think a win I think now is a must. And what's Premier. your prediction? I'm going to go 2-0. I think Kane will be in the goals sheet and um, Lamella. I think we can go there. Yeah, we kind of missed Lamella today, actually. Missed a bit of his, his kind of strength and uh, the way he, uh, I think, the way he chases back and wants the ball time sometimes gets the crowd up. I think we missed that. I think he'll be back in the team on, on Wednesday. And if so, you know, also, what's your, your score prediction? Um, I think we'll edge him out 2-1, I think, uh, Wednesday night. Uh, obviously, that's far the more important game after today. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel on YouTube. Follow us on Twitter, at TV. Cheers, guys. Thanks.